links between gum disease and prostate inflammation, and the x-ray surprise story out of the UK. Hi, I'm Allie Cook for the Dental News Network. Today is June 3rd, 2015, and this is your Wednesday Watch. Here's today's dental news. Treating gum disease can reduce symptoms of prostate inflammation, according to researchers. Previous studies have found a link between gum disease and prostatitis, and this recent research indicates that treating gum disease can improve symptoms and improve the quality of life for those who suffer the effects of the disease. Gum disease is a system-wide condition that can cause inflammation in various parts of the body, and this study comes after previous research found a link between gum disease and fetal deaths, rheumatoid arthritis, and heart disease. A Korean woman suffering from black gums has been diagnosed with a very rare form of skin cancer, malignant melanoma of the mouth. The 60-year-old had previously been healthy and did not drink or smoke. Unlike most cases of melanoma of the skin, oral malignant melanoma is not affected by UV exposure and has no apparent relationship to chemical, thermal, or physical events such as smoking, alcohol intake, poor oral hygiene, or irritation from teeth or dentures. The full case study can be seen in the New England Journal of Medicine. Coming up, an x-ray surprise and how kids are getting creative with pulling their teeth. Getting one's teeth knocked out in a fight is nothing new, but one young man in the UK surprised himself and his doctors at the emergency room after accidentally hitting his brother in the mouth while boxing the previous evening. The patient's hand was swollen and when it was x-rayed, a human tooth was found lodged between his finger joints. He had to undergo surgery to remove the tooth and one day later, doctors did confirm that the wound was clean with no infection or dead tissue. Kids have lost baby teeth in some pretty interesting ways lately. One young man had his loose tooth pulled out by his parrot, and a five-year-old girl got a hand from her U.S. Olympic gold medal winning father, javelin thrower Brian Clay, who attached a string to his javelin and then had at it. Then, one seven-year-old in Montana used a bow and arrow to remove a baby tooth that was ready to go. He calls it the Montana Tooth Pull. Check those out online. Thanks for checking out the Wednesday Watch. We'll see you next week with more from DNN and Dentistry Today.